We just had some nice rains here in Central Texas. So all the uh, palms are pretty happy. What you're looking at there is a Mediterranean fan palm. It's kind of interesting palms. They actually produce a lot of seed here in Central Texas. So if you kind of see right there at the base of the crown, you can see all the seeds. So this one has done pretty well over the years. It's kind of an interesting one also because it's a single trunk, um, Camerops humilis. Um, we have, you know, other ones like the one right next to it, which is a has multiple uh, stems coming out from it, uh, multiple branches. So, um, but what I'll do is kind of walk over we and show you some other examples. We actually have quite a few of them. This is actually another one, um, and I don't know if you can see the seeds, but we'll walk through here. Uh, we got a large uh, windmill palm. We have some needle palms. Uh, this is actually another. Uh, European fan palm, but if we kind of look around the back side of this palm, get a good look at sort of how prolific seed producers these are. So you'll note right in there, so this wraps around the entire base of the palm or the base of the crown. Uh, so those seeds are probably just about ready. Um, they'll start dropping. In fact, if you notice down here in some of our smaller palms, we're starting to see some of the seeds drop. So some of the birds get in there and eat some of these as well too. Um, typically, we just kind of throw them back in and let them uh, self-seed. Um, as you can see, there's lots of different types of palms tucked away back in here, kind of hidden underneath some of these elephant ears. Anyways, if you have a chance to try out the Mediterranean fan palms, they are, easy to grow. They do extremely well in Central Texas. Um, they, and also pretty much any other, they're a very cold hardy palm, so they'll do well in any type of cold environment. One of the things that's kind of characteristic of them, which is actually some people have problems with, is if you notice very sharp spines on these petioles. So these are very difficult, make it quite a challenge to get in there and clean up and prune some of these um, but palms make up for it you know just being such a good looking palm and able to handle such tough weather so give it a try